Duck Duck Goose by Girl Health TV. These are five ducklings and one gosling. They're layers, all girls. They're four days old. When you get your ducklings and your goslings, show them where the water is immediately. Provide constant food and water on clean pine flakes and don't overcrowd them. It is important to feed duck starter crumble. Organic, non-GMO food is best. Wet the crumble the first week. Never ever feed waterfowl medicated chick feed. Waterfowl require higher protein than chickens. Especially important is niacin, vitamin B3. They need twice as much as chickens. If feeding chick starter and not duck starter, use a 100 milligram supplement in their water every day for six birds. Niacin prevents leg deformities. If you still see the legs bowing or the hock swelling, increase the amount to 250 milligrams for the six birds. If only one bird is affected, take it aside and give it 50 milligrams with its water. That's an extra dose I know, but it's really hard to overdose your birds on niacin. Do it immediately, you don't have much time. When the legs straighten after a couple few days, put that chick back in with the rest. These six chicks are in a 36 inch by 18 inch tub. It has flakes in it, of course. You'll need other things like two of these. This is a feeder, it has water mixed in with the food. You need a second feeder, just like this for water. That way they won't jump in it and get it all dirty. It needs to stay very clean. Their environment needs to stay very clean. What they're walking on, what they're drinking, what they're eating. Throw it out if it's rancid or it's got poop in it. Throw it out. I also gave these ducklings another feeder. This is dry. There's no water mixed in with this. And you also need a heat lamp. If it's in the house, 100 watt is fine. If they're outside, you might need a 250 watt and you move it up and down. Keep them warm with the heat lamp. Put it in this brooder pen for them. If you're raising them indoors, one or two weeks is all that they will need for the extra heat. If they're outdoors, they're gonna need it longer and it needs to be hotter as well, even in your garage. If the ducklings pant, they're way too hot. If they pile on each other, they're too cold. When purchasing niacin, it must be in the form of nicotinic acid or niacinamide. I use Nature's Way brand, 100 milligram. Do not use flesh-free niacin supplement. Powdered niacin in a vegetable capsule works great in water or food. Ducks need approximately 10 milligrams of niacin a day. If you need to move your birds out of the house in a couple of weeks, make sure you get them in the summertime. When it's hot in the day, and over 60 degrees at night. This will protect them from getting pneumonia. When under six weeks old, don't let them bathe in the water. They can get cold very easily. Their wings are not yet waterproofed and they don't have feathers yet. Also, before you move them outside, have a four foot by eight foot outdoor pen ready for them. Use one inch chicken wire, that'll work but quarter inch hardware cloth is even better. Two by four construction will hold up to moving the pen on the fresh patch of grass every day. If you have a fenced in yard, all the better. It can be hard to get duck starter or gosling feed from Walmart or your local store, even the feed stores, a lot of them don't carry it. So a lot of people get turkey or quail starter but that has protein that is much higher than needed for ducklings and goslings, and because of that, it can cause angel wing. Here's some shots coming up at two weeks in the outdoor pen. They come inside in the evening before dark in a three foot by uh, four foot, 36 inch tall box. I still don't have the yard done and their outdoor facility done, so 
they come in every night on the deck. Here they are at six and a half weeks old. The ducks have a lot more feathers than the goose does. They look almost full grown, don't they? Au revoir. Like, share, and subscribe. And thanks from Grow Health TV. Eat well, live well. Ciao.